Hey guys, welcome back, Maris here, and today we, I'm gonna show you the quick fix, how to fix Fallout 76, because it's kind of broken, again, of course, there's a workaround. Uh, if you are really, really interested in just a fix, down in the description is one timeline where I'm skipping ahead, all the explanation, everything, and just how to fix it. If you are really in a hurry, go there, otherwise I'll go through and explain where, what, how this happens, as you can see. Um, I'll start with that, if not then yeah, let, we'll meet in, in the moment where I'm fixing it. So, uh, first things first, I'm just showing, I don't know, casual reason, um, drivers are up to date. Windows updates are as well, and this is really important, I am showing the test on um, refresh rate 144 MHz monitor, that is important, come on, stop it, okay, anyways, just update it, and important it is because frame rates are somehow bugged, I'm launching Bethesda, I have launcher on other screen, this, okay, we will we will be back in the same screen in a moment, so no worries. So one thing I need to make sure is if you can see up in the corner already frame rate counter that is from GeForce um, experience and it shows 65 frames per second. Of course this is menu, let me quickly show you the settings, mm, of course we are going for Ultra, this is maximum what you can have, the fade, everything, field of view is just 19, that's, that's suitable for me. It also impacts frame rate, but it doesn't matter for this moment, because you can see we are limited, of course, uh, my, my graphics card is struggling a little bit, but to fully test, let me just jump right into the game, <coughs> I need to... We will jump in the game in one and, and the same position, so the, the same view, the same distance and everything, of course, the, the, the uh, server day and night time might impact a little bit, but you will see this. I tested it many times because there's no benchmark or anything like that. So with these settings, maximum, ultra, full screen, and by default, the, the settings and everything, we'll see how my 144 hertz monitor, well, what we can get out of it. And I can give you already a little bit heads up, obviously I, I can't have that uh, 144, but I'll show you where the issue is and later on uh, how to fix it. Another thing mentioned here is I can give you my GPU currently load percentage this is also important why the game is broken, is 60%. So, you see, I, I am limited in frame rate. Like, gee, I have nothing near to 200, it's even less when I'm sprinting. But, yeah, in this corner... Oh, shoot, little buggers. Uh, and I'm placing so the counter is on the cliff of... So this is the screen I'm taking care of, okay, there's shooting going on, but I can't, you can see there's only 60 frames per second, 62, uh, so I can't pass it, and the obvious, obvious thing what you think is the best thing you can do, I will just skip ahead because otherwise the video will be too long, is you reduce the quality, and we could go with high, which is already... Um, reducing and you can see our frame rate should be a bit higher all right it's still the same but we will go even further than that let's think okay my computer is potato i can have nice things uh low preset texture down everything down everything is down we are we are not touching those two just fade and the quality and everything right Sounds reasonable. The thing is, yeah, you need to restart the game, so it takes effect. That's what we are. That's what we are doing. Meanwhile, let me check. Yeah, I'll, I'll just position it here. Okay, updates are done, as I said. Let's finish up. Bethesda launcher is closing up the game. 
and we are starting game with new settings. We lowered it from the ultra to the lowest, like like nothing. So now we finally, our sweet, sweet spot after 60 frames per second is coming up. Yeah, everyone is super excited. Yeah, no, don't, don't be. <coughs> settings are saved, the settings are the same. Uh, I can show you, no worries, we can go there. But the problem is, now graphics are like potato. Uh, texture, textures are down, they are not impacting that much. Uh, fade distance, all the objects, actors, shadows, you will see in a moment. I will show you right right away how, how bad it is. Like, we came from here down, like, well, even, even, even somewhere, I don't know, somewhere. Like, really. Because we are gamers, we expect to get some frame rates because frame rates is what what's what what matters. And well, you look at that. Uh, I just you see you see the shadows on 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 my my character. Those squared things. Yes, those are the shadows. This is this is how potato level we currently are. You see, this texture, it's its the lowest possible what we can have. And guess what? Look at the frame rates. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. It changes nothing. And let me check GPU um, percentage 57%. Basically, GPU is not even stressed out, not even close. And I have potato quality and frame rate still suck. Wow, how that how that can be? Well, the, this is Bethesda. Welcome to Fallout 76. Yes, this is Jackass. Uh, don't try to repeat it at home. No, otherwise, please repeat it at home. So what we will do? Fix it. And fix is quite simple. There is one extra setting that is not here. It is just not here. What we will do, <coughs> I'm doing already, putting back Ultra, because this is how I will play. As we just noticed, there's for frame rate, it doesn't help a thing. I need a restart, let's do a restart, and yeah, this this is the point I will, where I will put a timeline in, down in the description that leads right to here, how to fix this goddamn mess that is called Fallout 76. And of course, it is on a full screen, I'm not going bother to explain how borderless windows takes away half of the frame rate already it's, it's bugged just use full screen that's it and what we will do instead is boom shakalaka laka simple as that there are settings that is, that are not available in the game and that is we sync open up your computer click on your documents go in your documents, my games, and then you will find Fallout 76. This is where the settings, it's not location where it is installed, it's under documents, my games, Fallout 76. And open Fallout 76, press add, down in the description will be all the names, so it's easier for you. Open up this file, hit Control F, and I have already from previously what I found, well, in the internet you can find everything, I present will be enough because there's just one such entry full entry is I present interval which is well we sync which is one it means enabled we change it to zero it means kill that thing that destroys my gameplay and yeah remember we set back to ultra settings boom I'm launching the game Let's see, maybe it helps, maybe it do, do, doesn't, we'll see. Oh, you look at that number in the corner. Yes, the number is correct, we are in kind of play... <coughs> frame rates are not limited, basically, that, that, that's what it means. And my GPU is not such a potato and computer as well, because I can shoot out yeah, thousands of frames per second when it's still image or something. But let's see, just showing again, display. Ultra, everything, boom, 
let's jump in the game and stand in the same position where we twice had approximately 60 frames per second. Not more, not less, standing still, just a frame. Well, let's see, maybe it helps. Someone already closed the, the video and, and run and, and fixed, because obviously no one is watching further. You found the fix, I, I showed you the fix. Open my documents, my games. Fallout 76. Fallout 70... What was... Fallout 76 prefs. Any file. You can see in the corner there is... Uh, oh, you see? You see that? It's already 80? What? 100? What? Just what, when it's loading, it, it takes some time. I'm just past everything. You look at that. 100 frames per second. Who would thought? And remember, this is high quality. This You, you look at this quality. You could just marry this rock because it's beautiful. And of course, while I'm moving, the frames are dropping. Positioning camera the same. And we are at least 67. I know it's not much because my graphics card is only 1070. It's, it's not even 2070 Ti, nothing of RTX. But still, it's better. And if we want to, we can go and find a sweet spot. I would say sweet spot is something in between high. Well, this changes, those fade uh, distances change like a lot of things. You'll see. It's without researching, without any shadow dis change or anything, it's, it's 80 frames per second. Anyways, this is the fix. This is how you basically the only enemy in this game so far, with, 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 well, there's many enemies, is we sync because you can disable it in game settings. You need to go in any file and change one, one to zero. That's it. And this is the fix, as you can see. Frame rates are awesome. I, I see the benefit of having a um, monitor that supports 144. Otherwise, yeah, it's. I would definitely suggest to you, for you as well, doesn't matter what kind of monitor you have, just disable the V-Sync and see for yourself how your frame rates go up. Anyways, thank you for watching. No more jibri jabber from my side. Thank you, and we will meet in next videos. Hopefully, if you like the video, click share, share with the friends if someone else is struggling with frames per second. I will also link to the Reddit post. It was uh, three months ago posted the same, this this how to find it, that their uh, credit goes to the person. Uh, I'm just bringing it back because the same issue, the same frame rate and everything for Fallout 76 is still pretty bad. You need to go and find the workarounds to actually be able to play the game how it should be. Thank you guys, cheers, bye, and we will meet in the next videos.